Okay, I'm gonna give it just a minute before I start. Maybe someone will tune in. I'm gonna start in like two minutes and 15 seconds. So you guys, I got you guys some music playing in the background so it can be like as close to a normal video as possible. You know, with the lives, it's live. So I know with the other videos, I normally do music. So I thought it'd be cool to just kind of have the no copyright music playing in the background. you guys I'm gonna go ahead on and get started um today I'm doing a live boohoo haul it's an outerwear boohoo haul um so I thought well why not go live because when you're trying on like normal pants and tops and stuff it's just gonna take too much time to kind of go off the camera and come back and try it on hey Mary my only watcher <laughs> and so today is Monday and I normally go live on Tuesdays but tomorrow is gonna be so busy for me I'm supposed to go pick up my daughter's car and all that so go ahead on and go live because like I said it's been a busy week last week and this week and I'm trying to get back into the groove of doing my videos regularly and just being productive so I'm trying to I'm like okay I got a little time today so I'm just not gonna put it off and go ahead and go live um so I'm gonna get started you guys oh yeah and tell me what you think about my hair color um this is different for me I know I just do a black or all black so you guys make sure you tell me below what you think of my hair color um and we're gonna get started with the video so um this is gonna be a live boohoo haul and basically um it's all outerwear for two pieces so to keep me from trying on the pants i'm just gonna do them with like a whole nother video and just try on the outerwear and style them on camera so what i got on is like this all over um you guys have seen this before on one of my lives at my mom's house but it's just like an all over bodysuit and i'm gonna put everything on top of it and kind of switch out and show you guys how i will style it so the first look is going to be with this snake leopard well not leopard reptile snake print cameo so i'm going to hold it up first and show you guys so it's what i love about this is it's really thin so um it's perfect for this weather where it's it's starting to get hot but it's just not so hot where you can't wear something on top it's still really great oh uh, thank you mary so it's really breezy it's perfect for like windy days and um it's so long and so girly i love cameos that come all the way down i'm tall so this one comes like all the way down to like my ankles i love it i don't have much reptile print so i have really been into it lately i normally just do the leopard print so i thought this was so pretty and then it's like this gray and black color it's so flowy and then the sleeves um, they have like a little ruffle on the end. Now, I'm going to put it on. I'm going to tell you the only complaint I probably would have about this is, well, not really just a complaint, but I would just suggest, um, since this fabric doesn't have any gill, you definitely probably need to size up if your arms are bigger. Like, I have fatter arms at the top, and as you can see, it's kind of fitted. So when I move or reach, it kind of pulls a little bit. That's the only thing that I would be like, oh, wow, wow, I wish that it was a little bit looser and more comfortable. Um, other than that, I love it. I'm going to come back so you guys can see. But it goes all the way down, like almost touching the floor. It has the belt attached, but it has it like coming out and come closer. As you can see, it just kind of has it coming out the side. And 
the back is nothing. Both of the ties are just on the side. And then you can tie it. Of course, I when I wear it, I mean, it's totally up to you. I wear mine loose. I don't know. I just like the loose look. Um, you like it, Mary. I figured you would like this. But it's just so... Can y'all see it when I go back? It's too dark in here. Anyway, there ain't much I can do about it. But I'm going to get clothes anyway and then walk back. But it's just so flowy. And so, why don't you all turn the lights on? No, that doesn't make a difference. Anyway, it's just so flowy and so feminine. And I'm going to leave a link down below. This is like a whale. Um, but if I would have been thinking, because this fabric doesn't have any stretch, I definitely would have gotten a 14 because of the smugness in my arms. So, um, I'm going to go ahead and style this piece. So, I decided to add a silver layered necklace. And I don't have a lot of silver jewelry. I'm really into gold, but I do have this silver necklace and I thought it re really, really cute. It's a hard thing to keep these things straight, so I'm probably just going to put it on. But I thought it was written really, really cute with this um, cameo. Anyway, so I'm going to put it on my neck. And see, it just kind of drapes down. And it really kind of brings out the, the, cut, the braid that's in the cameo. And so, I did a pop of red on my lips, so I'm going to have red on with every lip look. Because I'm going to be red stains, and I'm not going to be able to wipe it off and come back. It was just taking too long. So I wanted to add a pop of color with this, so I did red high heels. So I just did the, you only wear silver? I said, I don't wear silver. I wear gold. Isn't that funny? And you know, but I'm kind of liking the silver. So I decided to add these, um, they're like this gold, bright red, and they're pointy toes. I love pointy toes. I think they look really, really sexy and just feminine, especially with you know, long pieces, and I'm gonna move the camera down a little bit so you guys can see because I know when I go back it's really dark. But um, and so this is what I paired up with this with this snake print, and I'm gonna move the camera down because I added this little clutch first, this little red clutch first, and it has like the little gold handle. And I'm gonna go down just a little bit and show you guys the complete look. So this is the snake reptile print. Cameo and the red pointy toe high heels and the red clutch. I think what I love about these is you can get away with wearing something really fitted underneath and still not really be showing everything because it's kind of open. It kind of gives you the illusion of the bodysuit, but at the same time, it's not showing everything. So I think it's just a really sexy look. I love cameos. Um, I love the thin fabric. Um, I just think it's just a really classy but still sexy look so i have um really gotten into cameo i'll order another one i'm going to show you guys i'm gonna go back up a little bit so you guys this is the first look i love the sleeves on i love the fact that it has the ruffle on the end it's so feminine like i said on things i just wish i would on the other side because the top part of my arms are, you know, kind of fatty, <laughs> fat, and so it's just fitted. But other than that, I love this one, you guys. And I'm scared as I return it that I don't know if any was going to be left in stock or whatever. So, this will be the first piece of my haul. And I'm going to have everything listed down below as soon as the video is over. So, we're going to take this off and move on to the next piece. checkerboard now this fabric is a little bit thicker than that sheer mist so this one has stretch in it, it definitely feel like polyester and maybe a little sandwich this actually has a lot of stretch i actually put a bound size in this one it's so crazy right like i should have went up the size in that one and i could have possibly got away with down size in this one so i absolutely love black and white and this one is not as long as the other one but it just has a little square cut out all over I love this print. I think it's really elegant and really stylish. And um, 
the sleeves are long, but they are wide enough to where if you want to cuff them up like your elbow, you definitely can do that. So I'm just going to quit talking, and I'm just going to put this on. <laughs> so this is going to be, let me take the shoes off. Okay, you guys, so this is going to be the second cameo. Like I said, this one is actually more roomier, roomier as you can see. I can close this one and everything. I love the color of this one. It's a little thicker than the reptile print, but it's still just as pretty. So flow, it's still flowy, just a little bit heavier. And like I said, it's long sleeve, but it is wide enough for you to cuff. So if you're up to long sleeve, you can definitely cuff it up and make it into like a quarter length sleeve. Or however you want to do it, you can wear it like that. You know, just to, if you're kind of like the hot type or whatever. You can definitely cuff it up and wear it like that, or you can leave it. I'm going to cuff it up today just to show you the different look. Okay, you guys, so <laughs> um, I kind of put red with this too, but I added another pop of color. I'll show you guys. So with the black and white, I really wanted to make it pop. So I think I told you guys this probably several times before, but when I want to make, what my light for? When I want to make, black and white pop, I tend to um, add red, you can know, do yellow, but I'm really into red, black and white, so I kind of ended up with some of the same colors, but what I was going to say, when you really want to make black and white pop, you can add gold, so I'm going to add a gold chain necklace. So this one here is layered, um, I actually ordered this one from a lady at work, she sells, um, um, initial initial outfitters initial whatever you call it so this one it actually has my <coughs> sorry i don't have corona i promise <laughs> i got strangled but this one actually has um my initial on it and i love it because normally i don't like really long necklaces but um this one i like because of how it drapes and when you have something on like this cameo it's really you can really see it good it has the shorter necklace and then it has the longer one coming down right here. And I love the gold with the black and white. Let me get on the phone so you guys can see. I don't know, I just kind of love gold, black and white. I think it really makes it pop. Can y'all see it? Because I may have too much time like anyway. I think it really makes, I'm going to go up just a little bit. I think it really just makes it pop. Um, and then I'm going to add red with this. <laughs> This is how I'm going to do it with this one, though. Well, first, let me add my shoes because I'm going to have to bend over. So, uh, this time, I'm going to add a strappy red high heel. So, this one here is really strappy, really feminine, um, toes out, perfect for the hot, cool weather. It's almost like a fancy sandal. So, um, I love these. It's kind of like has a velvet feel to it. So, I'm going to put these on. Okay, and I'm gonna step back and show them to you guys in just a minute. Okay, you guys, so, woo, I'm sweating, y'all, it's hot, that too, I think. So I'm working for this, for this haul. Anyway, I'm going to go back and see how it is really strappy. The other one was a pointy toe. These are strappy. Okay, I'm going to... Uh-oh. Did I fall? Me trying to move stuff, right? I don't know why my phone like it ain't got dark. So let me put it on the side and see if that goes. Like it's gotten really dark. I don't know why. Okay, so... Try to go down without knocking it over. I think they look really cute with that black and white. 
if I'm ashy, I'm sorry. I kind of say ashy this time of the year. But anyway, so what I did was, I'm going to put a belt in the middle of it because I love adding definitions to outfits because this kind of looks like it brings you in. So, I put a thin belt most of the time because sometimes a thick belt makes it look really bulky. So, I'm going to put closer. And I'm going to put this little thin red belt. Seems like my phone is going in and out with the brightness. Maybe I should keep it. No, that made it work. Okay. I don't know what's going on with it. Oh, it's too much brightness. So anyway, you guys, so I added a little thin belt, and I just kind of gather it a little bit around the waist when I add the belt. It won't look so, I don't know, it's kind of like a loose kind of. It, and then in the back, you know, just like a little red belt around the hold my shoes. I'm going to go down a little bit more. Okay. So this is it with the red belt. Really cute and stylish and a little necklace. I just love this combination. And I love this pattern and this print. So, boo-hoo, you did it with this one. It almost looks like a dress on the back, so it kind of, this one kind of layers out a little bit, and I think that's why I like it. It almost layers out like a dress, like I thought it was a closet, and it would look totally like a black and white dress. But I like it when you walk, because when you walk, when you have a bit like this, like your legs, kind of like a thick peekaboo action going on. So I really love that. This one was like one of my faves. I love this pattern. I love this print, you guys. So if you get this one, you can't go wrong. No, this is not sponsored, but we will have some really good prices. And most of the time when I check out, I always look for that coupon. And I'm telling you, just Google coupon goals and you're going to find one. So I never pay for the price for things and they're already pretty reasonable. And then I never pay regular price. Okay, you guys, so what I did was, I'm going to show y'all two looks. The first one I added this green first. It has like another color. A lot of times you can just add another piece, another color that doesn't have anything to do basically with the other colors. And just kind of give it a completely different look. So now you have black, white, and this teal green. This kind of first you can hold on your on your arm like this. Has a little gold buckle in the middle. It's a middle. It's a mic cord. So now you have black, white, and green. You don't have to have anything else green. You can just totally add that top of color. And it's really so fashion forward and really stylish. Lovely. So, oh, thank you, Mary. That's it with the green. And then if you don't like the green, you can totally do it with the red purse. Also have this shiny red purse. This is it with the red purse. If you prefer the red purse, you can do it the same way with the red shiny purse. This look is just more matchy matchy. Some people like to really match. So if you're kind of like a type that really wants to match from head to toe, the red would definitely be the color that you follow to go with. Sometimes I like adding another odd color to my outfit, just depending on what mood I'm in. So I can wear it either way. I would carry it with the red sometimes, and sometimes I would carry it with the green, just depending on how I'm feeling <laughs> and where I'm going and what statement I'm trying to make. So, you guys, this is the second piece, which is the black and white square cameo. Like I said, I leave all these pieces, um, the link to them down below with the video upload. Okay, you guys. Okay, you guys, so I'm going to try on the other, it's more like a kind of a I would say, I think some people maybe say it's a cameo slash jacket. But anyway, I'm going to try it on right quick for you guys. Okay, you guys. So this one here is like, oh my gosh, I love it. 
it's made out of this suede fabric. Um, I would say the the thickness is kind of like medium, not thick, but kind of like a medium. Um, really good quality. I really love the quality of this one. It's like a lightweight suede, so you could definitely wear this in the with it being breezy outside and you kind of get cool at night. I think this would be a perfect look. Um, it kind of angles down at the, in the front. Um, it has the angles in the back shorter. Really stylish, and then it has a tie belt to go around it. I absolutely love this. I saw it on the um, bottle. And I thought, oh, I have to have it. Now, this fabric is really comfortable. No pulling, nothing. Like, I guess I said, boy, the perfect size. I love, I'm going to come down just a little bit. I absolutely love the, the wide collar. As you see how it laps over, I love the way it kind of laps over my shoulders. And as you can see, it has like an uneven hem kind of come in points in the front and then in the back it's straight across i'm loving this tan brown color because you could just do so much with this color like you could just totally do a lot with this color it can go with black white green i mean it's just nothing that this color won't go with and i'm gonna put this hot down on with it so i'm gonna show y'all two different styles with this one because you could totally do it with the tie belt and the tie belt you could just do it. I mean you could do it one time, two times, and one thing. But you see how the tie belt just kind of add definition to your waist. Kind of just gives you come in and I love it because it's wide. You guys, I really, really like this one. Um I love the style of it so sassy, so feminine, so cute. I could just think of so many different ways to wear this. And I'm in love with the color. I love that the sleeves are wide at the bottom. You know, breezy day coming out, like if you've been somewhere and you come out, you know, sometimes you may have your, uh, you may have sleeves in the inside of the building, but you want to put on something going outside, since it's kind of cool, this would be perfect for that. And the color is fabulous, is it not? So I'm going to take out the red shoes and show you guys how I would style this. Uh, uh -huh. Okay, you guys, so... I added these shoes. Does this not look so good with this jacket? Oh my God, it was made for this jacket, right? I am in love with these like zebra stripes and they're corner so my face. I have to see, I'm gonna go down a little bit. Okay. Please don't follow the screen light. As you can see with the shoes, how cute. You have to get on here with that. And this right here is one look. So I want to style this in two different ways to kind of show you that you don't. You can always style it in a way to style it. You don't like maybe the shoes that I put with it or the purse. You can always switch it up. You don't have to go exactly by my style. You have your own unique style and it's fine. So I thought, well, I'm going to add like some leopard earrings. I thought these leather earrings was really cute and it really made the, the jacket pop. So I'm going to put it on with the leather earrings. You see that leopard up against that beige, how pretty that is? Leopard isn't, and look what it did for this brown jacket. And I'm gonna go a step further. A lot of times things come with belt, like it came with this belt, and I absolutely love this belt with it. But sometimes you just want a different look. So if you want a different look, you can definitely switch out the belt. I'm gonna show you how. Hold on just a second. 
you can make it final. So right here, I'm going to take a step forward. I'm going to take off the top. And I'm going to add this black belt that's outlined in leopard. So just don't be afraid to switch up. Add different accessories, belt, purses, and accessorizing can make something look totally different. Just by changing like the, you know, the necklace or the earring or like in this thing, the belt. And then I'll get close to you guys. This one here has a black belt. Down just a little bit. And see, you can see how it's outlined in leopard. And it just gives it a whole different look, right? Feel cute. I mean, just depending on what look you want for that day. And I love this brown and black together. Thank you, Mary. And I just love this jacket, you guys. I can hardly wait to wear this jacket. I just think it's so stylish and cute. And then with this, literally, you can just you can do either purse. I'm show you. You can even do this green purse. You can do this leather purse if you want to do. You can do this little clutch leopard purse. Super cute. This is kind of going inside with the color scheme that you have. The brown and black. Super cute. Stylish, or you can even use this green. Now look what the green does. I take it and see that little gold brownish buckle in the middle of the purse. How cute is this? So you just but isn't that cute? Super cute. Love green and beige and brown together. Totally love it. Don't have to do the zebra print shoes. You can definitely put on some plain black shoes. You can do red shoes. Just, you know, you can just have fun with your clothes and create so many different looks. I decided to style each one because it, I can still do it in the video and not be extremely long. And I just love styling, so I had so much fun. If you guys love the idea of me doing live um, hauls, then I can definitely do that with outerwear and shoes and different things like that, like accessories. Um, just let me know in the comments below. And I thank you guys so much for tuning in. And thank you guys for just all your support. And I will see you soon. Have a blessed day. Love ya.